Are you ready? Let's go inside Trader Joe's. Here's a taste. In the beginning, the store was not a success. In fact, it was scarily quiet. It's a new five-part series. We'll take you inside a Trader Joe's tasting panel. That's where decisions get made about which products you'll find in your neighborhood Trader Joe's. All right, so I think Finn JoJo's are great. Don't get me wrong. But today I have a cinnamon toast version for you in the classic format. We'll go to Napa Valley, California to sip some wine. There really are hundreds of thousands of wines available in the market. We carry about 500 in our stores. So... We're tasting every day, literally every day. We used to have some really, really uh, long wine tastings, and... and, uh... (laughs) This is really inside Trader Joe's. We'll help you discover new foods and new flavors. I love that lentil soup. It's uh, it's an elusive little beast these days, so... So I'll give you a suggestion. One of my favorites right now is in the refrigerated case, it's a split pea soup. It's an organic, vegan split pea soup. Oh, wow, cool. We'll meet the person who has the best job in the company, traveling the world looking for new Trader Joe's flavors. <laughs> I love Paris. so uh, But there are a lot of places I really like. I, I mean, I've been to so many countries and seen so many things and found really cool things I didn't know existed, a lot of which are in the store. I go to Southeast Asia a fair amount. We buy a lot of products there. I would say that in the store right now are the... Um, mango and sticky rice spring rolls. Those are fantastic. And in hindsight, we probably should have known that some of those products were going to be misses. Like what? Cotton seed actually is plentiful, abundant, and it produces lots of oil. And we thought, wow, if you just blend this up, whip this up, it's like a cotton seed butter. Who's not going to love this? Apparently no one <laughs> loved this. So... <laughs> So we get, a, we get a, lot, a fair amount of tourism. People come in and ask, is this really the first Trader Joe's? Was this where it's at? She says, Sonny, you know, I may not live to that fourth banana. <laughs> and they've been 19 cents ever since. We'll even hear from Joe himself. And that is why, to this day, the employees wear Hawaiian shirts. I'm Tara Miller. And I'm Matt Sloan. Maybe you've read Trader Joe's Fearless Flyer. Now we're really getting fearless with a new five-part series. Inside Trader Joe's. Subscribe on Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts. Sharing Trader Joe's with the world, you know? (laughs)